Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today is an exciting and fun video because we are talking about bath bombs and bath products. The products here are by Nectar Bath Treats. I don't know if you guys seen these food shaped um, bath soaps and bath bombs that are going around on Instagram and Facebook. And so the moment I saw that, I really had to check them out. behind the nectar bath treats are basically providing skincare products that are more fun and enjoyable and just kind of remembering the kid in us sometimes skincare and bath and body products are so serious nowadays nectar is handmade bath and beauty confections is simple clean ingredients inspired by nature this company is based out in las vegas and so i know it's like nine hours away from here with the drive but I was thinking, you know, I gotta check this company out because someday I could go there and visit. And I've seen their Instagram posts and YouTube videos, and they do have like a store there, kind of like a bath and body work store where you can go and try the products, try their hand soaps, try their bath bombs, and kind of see how they actually perform. Seeing that store is kind of like walking into a candy store for adults. Nectar Bath Treats is cruelty-free, sulfate, plant-based, paraben-free, and they are all handmade. I was automatically sold. And then plus you add that kind of uh, edible shapes, like food-shaped items. It's just so fun to see and just use. So I was so excited in picking this. I did pick the bath items based on my daughter's um, preferences because that's how I bond with her through spas and baths. So I'm gonna tell you guys what I got. And then at the end of this video, I will show you one or two of the products in action. So let's go ahead and get started. This is the box that I got, guys. I tried to do my best to grab a variety of products that I could show you guys without really breaking the bank. They are a little pricey. They're around um, 14 to $30 per item. The first thing in this box is a bath bomb. This is kind of like a mystery bath bomb that I chose and it was heavily discounted, but you don't get to choose the flavor or the scent that you're getting. So that's the only uh, downside. I was kind of underwhelmed by the packaging because as you can see, it's in this um, tissue paper material. I felt like with the price, they should have been individually packaged nicely in a little box. Right away, like I'm smelling strong eucalyptus, kind of, yeah, peppermint, like minty scents. So this is what the bath bomb looks like. It's a bright green. When I saw it, I was like, oh, green, not fun. And that's probably why they did the mystery item. But reading about it, this one definitely has some great benefits. Um, this is the Awaken Your Senses Bath Bomb. It has peppermint, shade, sage, and juniper berry. Depending on the bath bomb, there are certain types of ingredients that go into them. So not all of the bath bombs are made equally the same. So it just depends on what you pick. This one in particular is made up of sweet almond oil, Epsom salts, which is pretty much present in most bath bombs, and then bentonite clay. So the bentonite clay was interesting. It's something that I've never heard before. It apparently has a strong negative electromagnetic charge that draws or pulls metals and toxins from the body. I think I'm gonna save this for myself because this is definitely like something that I need. Bentonite clay, it's, is it kryptonite? I don't know. Um, but it just sounds so serious how it's like, it acts like a magnet to extract all those toxins from the body. So I'm so for it, even though I'm not so much into the color, I'm definitely into this. So do you guys like my Hershey's cup? I got it from Las Vegas actually, when I went to visit their Hershey's store. Super cute. The next item that I got is another bath bomb, and this is the Lavender Blossom Foaming Bath Bomb. Ah! I almost dropped it. <laughs> Again, it's $6. All of their bath bombs are priced the same, um, but you know, obviously my daughter chose this because of the shape. I love like lavender scents, and I feel like lavender has that calming aroma to it. 
Mm. Ooh, mine has a little bit of a crack. But actually when this package arrived because of the heat i think it started to kind of melt or moisten a little bit so it has herbal notes of lavender chamomile and warm honey soothing epsom salt it's supposed to calm the spirit it will color your bath water with a delicate purple while creating the ultimate bath time experience so this is gonna be a colored bath so that's gonna be fun you know now that i have these bath products i'm curious is how they're supposed to be stored I mean are we gonna keep them in tissue paper because I want to keep them cold and also I don't want like the different soaps to mix with one another let's do the green tea bath tea okay I had to do it I had to try one of their bath teas look how cute it is it's like one giant tea bag um Ooh, it definitely smells like green tea, guys. Um, indulge your senses in the age-old tradition of herbal bathing. Enjoy a relaxing and aromatic experience with herbal bath tea. This recipe includes green tea extract and chamomile blossoms, which will help soothe and soften weary skin. I love the idea. So you're supposed to put it in really, really warm water, like warmer than warm. Just let it steep like a tea bag oh my god it smells so good it has that earthy scent but also that fresh bath scent so i love it hmm, there's three of these here guys so you let it steep for a couple minutes and then when the water is like warm enough or just a little bit cooler then you can finally get in it's twenty dollars guys a box of this is twenty dollars and you get three uses out of it this green tea extract has lavender and oatmeal oh oatmeal is really good with people with eczema when you have itchy dry flaky skin i think this is my favorite this is like the adult version of of these bath treats for sure with this bubble bath so look at this this is called bubble scoop so isn't that cute so I got the mix and match bubble scoop where there's three in here. They're in this kind of, you know, ice cream sundae container and they look so good and they look like ice cream scoops. They look like they're good enough to eat. Look at this. Oh my gosh. This blue one smells so good. I've got this pink one and then the blue one. And then I also have a pink yellow swirl. And they all have a little bit of glitter, but I was told that there's no glitter because can you imagine going into a bubble bath and then you come out like a unicorn goddess? <laughs> like full of glitter. That's kind of half annoying, but kind of nice as well. <laughs> but I love the little detail to it that it's kind of sparkly. The pink and white is the lychee or lychee hibiscus the blue and pink one is the unicorn candy of course i would pick the unicorn right yellow and pink is peachy lemon i think i did some pretty good choices guys peachy lemon yes you do kind of smell the citrusy scent mm. and you can actually get up to six uses out of this um, according to this you can just break the, the scoop this one scoop in half and just put a half scoop in your bath or you can put the whole thing but i feel like it's such a small one if it was as big as like you know the bath bombs i feel like this is a half size compared to the bath bombs then i definitely break it in half but this seems like too tiny i don't know if it's gonna really give you that um amount of bubbles that you really want with just half a scoop are they edible because they are all natural right all natural plant-based so i wonder if they're edible nectar bath treats if you're seeing this video can you answer that question for me are these bath treats edible probably not because it's still soap there's still some cleansing ingredients never mind they just look too good to eat Oh, I forgot to tell you guys, three scoops is $20. So this one whole container right here is $20. It looks like whatever bubble bath flavor or scent that you get, it contains 
the same ingredients which is the shea butter and the apricot kernel oil unlike the bath bombs they could have different oils different ingredients um, but the bubble baths are all the same <sighs> okay this is what I was kind of disappointed in because I saw somebody unbox a nectar bath treat and they were packaged in this little cute container. They were just wrapped in tissue paper and this is just too beautiful to be wrapped in tissue paper. Oh my gosh, it smells so good. Can you guys guess what this is? What do you guys think this is? Okay, show you the back. It, this is a soap it's basically smells like a pina colada like very tropical it says here it's a sweet treat that takes your senses to the beach all of their bath soaps are shaped in some kind of food they have a donut shape they have an ice cream bar shape they have pie slices they have macaroons they have bar soaps and also they have like a rubber ducky shaped soap smells so good my daughter picked the donut one this is eleven dollars guys so you can lather this onto your loofah the ingredients are definitely similar like coconut oil palm oil safflower oil glycerin water i thought i would get another soap just to get a nice variety and i couldn't resist i think this is the best looking one that they have is their cupcake soap look at that super super pretty so they kind of like frost their cupcakes by hand it looks like they're baking when they're making these so they have the you know the cupcake container or paper and then there's your little soap and actually when it arrived the base was separated from the you know the frosting on top i think it was because of the heat that they separated so i contacted nectar bath treats and they were so easy to talk to they gave me a refund right away they said that if they come apart you could just wet the base with some water and then stick the top back in and they'll stick together and so they're stuck on pretty good see Ooh, upside down okay um the, the one i got is called the rainbow twist cupcake and because it's shaped like a cupcake it's much more expensive it's 14 dollars, guys bursting with juicy aromas of peach apple pear pineapple coconut wild berry jam vanilla oh oh my gosh if you're filipino you guys know how the four seasons juice tastes like this is exactly the scent that I'm getting. Four Seasons Juice Drink. <laughs> it smells so good. Okay, now I want that juice drink. <laughs> the last one. Okay, I got this the Cactus Blossom Sugar Scrub. So they are body scrubs and they look like this. I love the scent of it. And it looks like this, guys. I'll show you how it looks in the sink and see the texture, but it's basically has a lot of sugar. What I love about these bath scrubs is that depending on the flavor or scent that you get, it has different types of ingredients in them. So I got the Cactus Bloom Sugar Body Scrub and it has fresh poppy seeds. I was wondering what these little dots were. Can you guys see that um they are poppy seeds so they give you kind of like that mild exfoliation on your body and then it also has sweet almond oil i love anything almondy i think that's my favorite scent almond scent and it also has a rich shea butter oil filled with vitamins a e and it has coconut oil and the coconut oil is farmed in the philippines i grew up in the philippines born and raised there this is great that they're getting their coconut oil from the philippines i've already tried this guys i tried it in the bath the other day very hydrating especially when i had itchy kind of 
irritated skin basically i did this and i got out of the shower and i didn't feel the need to actually put on a lotion right after you get that mild exfol exfoliation you get the sugars and the scent is not strong at all even though it's kind of strong here from the bottle because it's so concentrated um the bottle is plastic guys this is 30 dollars by the way and i was hoping that i would get this in a glass jar you know for 30 dollars now to my surprise i bought one but i got four extras i got fruit smoothie the peach sangria asian pear lily lavender blossom i'm just gonna consider this as pr and say thank you to nectar bath treats i think this is a great way to try all of the different products actually my daughter tried it it smells good the lavender blossom sugar i am planning to keep because i love lavender and then i'm also gonna keep this asian pear lily it's one of the most popular fragrances it smells so good so good like pear with some citrus oh by the way for the lavender one these little seeds here are the blueberry seeds i am gonna keep the asian pear lily as well and probably give it to my mom or family member and these guys i did not open and I am putting this in a giveaway. As you can see, I am already at 400 and I'm so thankful to all my subscribers. It feels so satisfying when I make these videos and somebody's actually watching. <laughs> I am so appreciative and thankful for all the support and I really wanna give this to my loyal subscribers. So these two bath treats, sugar scrubs are for you guys. All you have to put in the comments are enter me. I'm gonna make this as a secret giveaway. I'm not gonna announce it on the title or anything. I think you guys will really, really love this. I mean, what a treat, right? Especially if you're a skincare lover. So that is everything that I got. Stay tuned at the end of this video. I'll kinda show you guys one or two of the products in action. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up like and subscribe to this channel if you haven't already i post videos once a week on skincare and beauty reviews and i also do some unboxings here and there so i hope you guys stick around there's always something to learn here on my channel um and with that said i hope you guys have a great rest of your day and i'll definitely see you back in my corner soon bye